Granted, that is one of the reasons why when I was first creating Shepard, I was thinking about making myself something like a Sentinel. Or, uh, yeah, a Sentinel. Because then that way it was biotics and uh, tech. Which, to be honest, thinking about it, probably would have been pretty good. But through Mass Effect 2 and 3, I plan on being Vanguard. And I figured if I'm going to be Vanguard, I might as well be Vanguard throughout all three of them. Although maybe for this game, maybe I should have just made myself tech. Commander, there have been reports of noise from the Synthetic Insights office. Would you know anything about it? It's probably Analeas' thugs ripping the place apart. Smart ass, huh? That's fine. I can work with that. Meet me at the hotel for a drink before you talk to Keen. I'll be waiting. Hmm. Gianna, it seems like there's a little bit more to you than meets the eye. You're not just the boring blah blah receptionist I thought you were. Yeah, but what I was saying also before I went in there, since I've got a bit of walking and talking time, what I was saying before we went in there, was I wish I'd brought Caden and Garrus with me to Theorem when we picked up Liara, because them two have some quite interesting speech options about the place and about Liara and all that sort of stuff. As does Ashley, by the way. Rare, Ashley has something good to say. But, um, and I really wish I'd taken Rex and Tally with me to Pharos, because Tally gives you loads of insights about the Geth, as I actually mentioned why I was there, and I should have brought Tally. But she gives you loads of insights about the Geth, and Rex just loves you because he gets to spend the whole time killing stuff. <laughs> and he's, at the end of it, he says how much he enjoyed that mission because he got to spend the whole day killing Geth. So, I mean, with hindsight, I wish I'd probably done taken that same combo with people, but it's sort of in a different order. But hey ho, it's done now, isn't it? Anyway, Diana Parasini, what do you have to tell me that's so important? Allow me to reintroduce myself Parasini, Novaria Internal Affairs. Ah, that's why I, you want to meet me here. Why is an internal affairs agent here? The executive board knows about Analeas' corruption. I've been undercover for six months. I want you to convince Keen to testify before the board. With his evidence, this planet can run profitably again. You work for Analeas. Can't you just take his records? <laughs> He's a crook, not a moron. He doesn't keep logs on his computer saying, This month I stole three million credits. Keen's testimony and records are everything I need to prove Analeas' guilt in one package. Why don't you ask Keen directly? I'm Analeas' secretary. You'd think he'd believe me? That he'd meet me in some dark alley with his evidence? I thought corruption was the rule on Novaria. The rule is don't rock the boat. Self-interest is tolerated if it doesn't interfere with business. Analeas is driving customers away. Huh, she has a very good point, but does she really have to shout at me? I'd like to help you, Miss Parasini, but I need Keen's garage pass. It's vital to my mission. Yes, yes, fate of billions and all that. I couldn't possibly understand how important your work is. In the long run, it is better to remove the source of the problem. Look, Shepard, I don't like this either. You specters play fast and loose with the law. That's bad for business. You gave me the company line about Peak 15. What's the truth? Before the weather closed in, Hanshan received a Code Omega signal from him. Code Omega means a terminal breach of safety protocols. No one goes up until the crew sends an all-clear. That doesn't tell me much. That's all I've got. No one knows what's going on up there. And if the crew never sends an all-clear? The executive board votes whether or not to destroy the facility. One antimatter warhead from the battle stations vaporizes all contaminants. Do you know why the Matriarch is here? Something to do with Peak 15. She arrived after we received their Code Omega, automated warning of a containment breach. She came with an escort of Asari commandos. They took the last shuttle up to Peak 15 with a load of crates. Do you know what she had in the crates? No idea. The commandos wouldn't let anyone near them. They seemed heavy, though. Don't tell me their crates were for Geth. Oh, at, least, at least we know now Benezia arrived after the issue. All right, I'll help you. All right, I'll talk to Keen and see if I can convince him. Thank you. You know where I work. Come talk to me once you know if he'll play ball. No, no, no! <laughs> Don't go back to where you work. That's all the way down the lift and across the other side of the room. Stay there in the corner. Chat with Vargas. I'm sure he's a nice guy. Yeah, but he said that we need uh, Lorik Quinn's pass, but we actually don't because we've already got permission from Manalayas. But as I say, more experience points and it's more to be done. Always a pleasure, Spectre. Any news on that matter I asked you to look into? 
I finished the job, but an internal affairs investigator contacted me. She wants you to testify against Analeas. Now that you have my property, you want to dictate how I use it. I have no interest in a public spectacle. Everyone on this station is chafing under Analeas' extortion. You might end up a hero. My employers rely on the goodwill of the executive board to work here. If these executives don't blame Analeas for provoking this, they're fools. You should eat them. All right. It is obvious that I cannot dissuade you. Very well. I will testify. Make whatever arrangements you need with your contact. I will wait here. <laughs> oh my god, I do love Rex. These people will smile. <laughs> if they don't do this, they're fools. You should eat them. <laughs> oh, I, I think I'm starting to bring a new rule with this. Bring, Re bring Rex on every mission. There was a mission... Um, well, there won't be a mission. When I was on the Citadel before... Oh, actually, no, thinking about it, I could probably still do it. There's this really cool line that um, Rex deals off while he's on the Citadel while speaking to some of the C-Sec uh, security. I was going to tell you what it is, but actually thinking about it, after Novaria, we're heading back to the Citadel anyway. I want to pop on back there, so <laughs> there's no reason why I can't bring Rex along with me. Yeah, in fact, I'll keep that one under wraps for now, because that one's quite a good one. But, um, yeah, like on all my side quests, Tally seems to be like a constant like team member to bring along on side quests I'm thinking that maybe Rex might be a constant one to bring on main missions these lines are just far too hilarious to not bring him along but then at the same time I tend to bring whoever I think will be good for the story so hey ho Spectre have you given any more consideration to my offer it took some persuasion, but Keen has agreed to testify. <sighs> That's a world of stress off my back. I'll take the evidence for safe transport. <laughs> I didn't think you'd help me, being a specter and all. I guess some of you can be all right. Doesn't this help you? You don't seem particularly happy. I'm ecstatic, but right now, I just feel like a long day of work is ending. I have an arrest to make. Wish I had time to change into something easy to move in. I hate skirts. This is an outrage. I'll see that you never work in this sector again. Yeah, yeah, get a move on. You, Shepard! I demand you place this bitch under arrest! You have the right to remain silent. I wish to God you'd exercise it. See you around the galaxy, Commander. I owe you a beer. Woo! Good, good, good. Now, I got a feeling my decryption skill was going to be too low, but if you go into Analay's office, office afterwards... Yeah, wall safe. Description <laughs> description still skills too low. But there's a wall safe here and you can get a bunch of credits and stuff like that off of it. Ah oh, dear dear dear. Decryption, decryption, decryption. As I say, I, I again could go and get Tally now and decrypt all this stuff, but you know what, I can't be bothered. <laughs> I really can't be bothered. But um with regards to getting Analias arrested and stuff like that, um if you done what I did and got like Oplod or whatever his name is to give up the parcel when you give it to Analyze. Analyze gives you the pass. But even if you do it that way, I definitely recommend doing all this stuff with uh, Loric Quinn. Because uh, people like Gina, Parasini and whatever, you do meet them later on, like in other games and stuff. And the more missions you do like this, and the more stuff like side missions and stuff like that you do, the better it, it will be in the long run. Gianna warned you that there has been an accident on Peak 15. Oh, so basically that rumour has now been confirmed. So do we have to go up now and talk to Loric Quinn again, or is the matter being fully resolved? Oh, there we go. Now, <laughs> now my charm has gone up another level. <laughs> now I don't need it anymore. <laughs> oh, God damn it. But anyway, at least charm's maxed out. I should never have an issue chatting to people charm-wise, at least. All right, barrier advanced barrier. Assault training. Hmm... Increase weapon damage. I'm gonna stick in shock trooper. The aura, I've got one for you. Let's stick it in. More electronics, that's not decryption, is it? <laughs> Your singularity actually does some pretty big damage sometimes. I might stick it in that. Yeah, actually, singularity, you're the only one who has that, so I might as well give it. Stick it there. And I don't care about stasis, so I'm not gonna bother upgrading barrier. 
So, let's put this one in. Hmm. What am I going to want? Master Throw, Master Immune to be, Master Carnage. You do use shotguns quite a bit, Rex, don't you? Let's stick it in your shotgun damage. Let's have a look at the map. Do we need to... Oh, there's no, there's no harm looking. All right, let's go up and see Lorik Quinn. I mean, if we needed his garage pass, we would go up. We'd need to go up and see him now anyway. But let's go up and give him a visit anyway, because for all we know, he might give us a couple of credits on top of it. And seeing as how I'm not decrypting anything at the moment, I might need to gather all the credits I can right now. I mean, I'm pretty loaded, but I can always be more loaded. Yeah, so as I said, even though I wanted to be Vanguard throughout all three games, I'm really thinking that maybe I should have made him Sentinel just at the start, just so I can get my, so I can have my own decryption skill upgraded. I mean, yeah, Adept and Vanguard are good classes, but for biotic skill, but I definitely say giving yourself an attack like an Engineer or Sentinel is definitely good, because then that way you don't have to worry about what squad mate you have with you. You constantly have a good tech level. Ms. Parasini contacted me as she lifted off World. The board will be taking me into protective custody. I expect I will be testifying in the next few days. Ms. Parasini contacted me as she lifted oh, off well, world. That's that then, I guess. <sighs> Fair enough. Well, that is everything here. That is everything for synthetic insight sites. And that is everything for this whole entire area done. It is time to go off to Peak First 15 and find out what is happening with the matriarch Benezia. What, con what contamination it was she was there to try and sort out. And maybe Liara will get some answers herself. And with any luck, hopefully Rex will get to headbutt something too. So always the dream. Shepard's good for many, many things, but I don't think he could ever compete to the headbutt of a Krogan. Or maybe he could. <laughs> Only time will tell. Okie pokey. Lee, there's no reason to talk to you, even though you seem pretty cool. Yeah, catch you later, buddy. Finally, let's get up to peak 15 and let's find out what's happening here. Uh-oh, one of Benezia's spies, is it? So that's what Whoa, that is a Geth Destroyer. Alright, I see these. This is where Liara is going to come in handy. Singularity, let's get that thing off the wall. And just in case I miss Rex, you can... Oh, actually, I will lift this one up. Liara, what happened to your Singularity? Oh, there it is. Maybe she just needed to wait until he stopped moving. Oh my, okay, Marksman. Uh, Rex. You can hit Carnage on this destroyer. And Liara, if you'd hit a warp on it. That, actually, no, Liara. Stasis on that Geth destroyer. Stop it coming at me. Oh, great. That one's dead, and now I've got... <laughs> The aura, stop the stasis on him. What the? What are they? Oh, that—that that was abrupt. Okay. What did you do here, Commander? Me? I'm the victim here. The Geth attacked us. Geth, you expect me to? Where did they come from? The Asari bitch came with a bunch of cargo. They were probably packed in those. I don't believe that. We did thorough scans of those. There were no power sources, no element zero masses. If Benezia Sama's containers were packed with these things, there are many more out there. I need numbers, Captain. A dozen? A hundred? Dozens, at least. They're machines. You could pack them tightly. I must report to the executive board. If word gets out about loose geth, there may be an investor panic. I kind of feel sorry for her. She's just trying her best, and she's had a really bad day. Geth in her ship, 
rogue, <laughs> rogue, or bribed or corrupted agents of hers running around shooting things up. <laughs> she hasn't had a really good day, has she? Uh, it looks like there's nothing really to decrypt around here. There's a Mako out there. Oh, an upgrade kit. Colour me corrected. Oh, there's a vehicle here. Oh, that's a vehicle we can't get into. It looks like we're going to the Mako out there. Do not be fooled by these civilized surroundings. Secrets and lies. Hmm, true. It's also be a, about to be a place where we are going to ride the Mako. <laughs> we can't do one main mission without hopping in the Mako, can we? As if the side quests aren't filled with enough Mako driving. They have to put it in the main missions as well. well I suppose there are out those out there who don't do any of the side quests, so for them, this is the only time they get to do it. Oh, we are driving into a level 1 hazard, it appears. 